the first time you heard me say this. Dearly beloved, we are gathered here today to celebrate the holy matrimony between you and your repressed anger. It's going to be a blessed union. So what I'm going to be inviting you to do is open up the cells of your body getting very primal to release the anger that you store inside the cellular structure of your body, physically, emotionally, mentally, and spiritually. We're gonna jump off a cliff into the anger that you may or may not even know that you carry inside you. What would happen if you kept all your poop, all your fecal matter in your large intestine and never let it out? What you don't release will rot you from the inside out. So I'm not asking you to release your anger and get primal to be beautiful. I'm not asking you to do it to feel good. I'm asking you to do it so you can be authentic and so that you can be healthy. We will use no words in this exercise. It is you being primal. Oh, what does an animal out in the wild do when it's angry? Yeah, it makes noise. It doesn't sit there and suppress it. It doesn't talk about it. It growls, it shakes, it might even bite. Mm. Some of us might say, well, JP, I don't have anger. I don't feel angry. I never get angry. I never yell. I would dare say that means you've realized you're in denial of your own anger and good for you. I'd ask you to consider this. Life is the most rageful experience we can ever live through. Have you ever seen a baby born? It comes out laughing. Not unless it's the Dalai Lama. Okay, just imagine for a moment, there you are inside your mother, you're in an oceanic consciousness of oneness where you're fully supported, fully safe, you're in blissful unity. And then all of a sudden you tumble down what feels like certain death to you. It's something that the rest of us call life. But you're taken away from your creator, your mother. How rageful do you think that might be for us? And I would dare say all of us carry sentiments of anger, oceans of anger, just because we're alive not to mention everything else that's happened in our life. You've just seen some real radical clips of people releasing genuine anger. They're screaming it out. So I'd like to stop and ask you a quick question. What are the feelings that come up inside of you? Does it frighten you? Are you judging them? Are you angry about seeing people release their anger? So I'd like to ask you to consider that how you're judging and feeling about these scenes of people screaming on your video right now, it's giving you valuable information about potentially how you feel about your anger. And you can awaken with JP by clicking here, subscribe to my channel, and I'll look forward to seeing you there.